Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Tailored Breaks. I am your host, Mike, and of course, in this episode, I have Miss Break, Mrs. Break. <laughs> oh, um, and of course, this is the result of our infamous pack battle where I pulled a gold card, and it was pretty much downhill from there. So I won. No suspense at all, right from the start. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much as bad as it could possibly go. So, with this, I won the honor of opening this Brilliant Stars Elite Trainer Box. Uh, just because you participated in the battle and you did get a nice card, I'll let you open a couple packs. But, uh, let's just get the packs out of here because I don't think anybody really wants to see anything else in terms of dice or any of that good stuff. I must say, the boxes are nice for these. They do a nice background. But they got inside art too. They do. They're well done. So here is the code card if anybody wants that. And uh, these are the card protectors. Real nice. And uh, yeah. So this pack comes with eight, eight different packs. So, uh, all brilliant stars, of course. So, let's break into these and see if we can get some pulls. I'm not super familiar with uh, brilliant stars, so if I get anything crazy, let me know. Because uh, I could very easily bypass a pull. So, the struggle for pack open, My struggling of pack openings is still a thing. I don't know what the number is for this, so we'll try with four. It might be three. What's the black card? I don't know. So. Cleansing gloves. Oh, oh. I'm not going to read them. They're, they're, I was going to say. I'm know, like... the name, I want to read them, but the names are too hard. The animations are nice on these cards, but they're nice on basically all of them. I've yet to see any that are... I know not everybody's... Farfetch? Wow, yeah. that's a ugly farfetch. I don't mind it. Really? I dislike yeah. it greatly. Oh, wow. Okay, so we got a full art octillery? Octillery? I don't know. Uh, I'm butchering this. I promise I'll get better with the names as I go. But, uh, yeah, that's a nice nice card. It's not going to set the world on fire, but it's a nice, a nice starting point. And then the non-hollow and uh, the V-Star card. So... Can't go wrong with that. A uh, good first, first pull. Get that out of the way. I was gonna say, do you? Getting better at it. I am. One day I'll be able to really rip these packs oh, real another fast. Another farfetched. Another farfetched. Another code card. What do the card cards do? You get online cards. Right? Can you use them for anything? Uh, yeah, you play online. Oh. Uh, so fire energy, a double turbo energy. That's how you know it's going to be a good pack. Is that my second far fetch of the say pack? pack? Yeah. I don't know that. Way. No, it's because I did the. Uh, no. Yeah, I was going to say I'm like, I like far fetch, but I don't <laughs> like them that much. That's a cool looking grimer. That's a nice I grimer. like that grimer. Badoof. Oh, peanut butter. Oh, that's nice. A two? Two of them. Back to back. Non-holographic and reverse holographic. So, not as good as the first pack, but, you know, I'll take it. Not that I have any other choice. <laughs> uh, would you like to open a pack? Sure, I can open a pack. Let's hope your luck's better than mine. It's not usually... Well, spoiler. Spoiled star, you. It's one of my favorites, too. So then that's the code. Mm -hmm. And I have to count how many? A four. One, two, two three, three, four. four. And, then and then put that. Yeah. So when we get to the star, you, we already saw yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. Nope, nope. Turn it around. Turn it around. There nope. we go. I'll get better at it. Okay, so energy card. Crawdon Ultra Ball. 
I'm, I'm done. I'm not saying them. There's my Star You. Star You is always one of my favorites. Cara Blast, Clefairy, Cherubui, Sock, and so Reverse that... Hollow, Motham. Motham? Mm. Sure. And ooh, ooh, he's nice. V Star, can you pass me a sleeve? I'll sleeve this bad boy up right away. Not a bad pull if we were doing a competition. This, well, it's not beating a gold card, but this would be a contender for this one. Nice yeah. pull there. Might have to. Get, oh, it's because Poke Cat entered the room. Let's take a look at Poke Cat. Sorry about the mess, but there's Poke Cat in all of her glory. When Poke Cat comes, that means that we're going to get a good pull. Just uh, I'm just neglecting the fact that Poke Cat's been here for every bad pack that I've ever had. <laughs> Isn't that right, Poke Cat? Oh, the struggle is real. Oh my gosh, it is. Yeah. Do you want me to open it for you? Maybe I should. Maybe you should open all the packs. I'll do color commentary. Ooh. Yeah, I'm reading them in my head, and I, they're they're tough. Trap inch. There we go. Execute. I know that one. Startling. Excal Excalibur. Oh, and the luxury non hollow. Yeah, that pack can just go right in the garbage. <laughs> Watch somebody be like, "Oh my god, there is a rare card in there," and you said it was garbage. Well, with my limited knowledge, from what I saw, that pack was straight trash. The struggle. It's real. It, it, it builds suspense? suspense for my viewers. Because they're like, how can one man struggle so much at opening a pack designed for kids? You would think after 50 to 100 packs so far on this channel, I'd be able to open these packs. But clearly, no. It's just getting worse. <laughs> I didn't want to say It is literally it. getting worse. This pack better have four Charizards in it. <laughs> I'm just going to hand it off. I'm done. Oh, gosh, almighty. I really want... I If you rip this open right away, it's... Well, one side I find open more easily than the other well, side. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Those spoilers. Okay, so then I put it like this. Yeah. Okay, and then this is the code. Yeah. Oh, it's upside down. That's fine. We'll be able to scan it. Oh, that's right. They're scanning. So one, two, three, four. No, I did. I can't count. One, two, three, four. Yep. And then like this. Yep. And then I flip it over. Yep. Okay. So energy. Tropis. So I, I'm, I'm not going to read them. They're too hard. <laughs> you keep answering back and forth. I want to read them. I want to read them so badly. They're just. They're hard. <laughs> Chimchar, I know that one. Oh, he's cute. Oh, is that our shiny? Is that the Morton? Clang. That's the reverse hollow. Oh. And then Mewtwo. Nice card, but it's non holographic, so. It's fine. It's what it is. It is what it is. Oh, you were supposed to show the cards. I was just opening a card. That's you, fine. You, you, you take, yeah, you take control. Like, you know. Yeah, no, I find one side is easier to open than the other. So if you're struggling, flip it around and do the other side. Maybe that's just me. No, it's... It's upside down. Everybody gets the point. One, two, three, four. Oh, Barry? Barry. Oh, another climb. Poke Cat came back, so that means I'm getting a pull. Looks like a glove. Tutwig. Oh, another Mewtwo. Way to go, Poke Cat. Way to go. I like Tutwig, though. Yeah, it's a nice reverse. This is the Charizard pack, so. No pressure here, Charizard pack. 
I got a pack once and it was there's two Charizards in it back to back. The only problem is it was like the least valuable Charizards in the world. You might have to let your nails grow out. I might have to, or just use my exacto knife to cut open every pack. See, one side's easier to open than the other. Okay, so hopefully we have better luck. This oh, I just revealed it, and we did have better luck. That's a nice card. Yeah. And Grim's Marvel. Let's it? leave it up. There's your sleeve. Good job, Poke Cat. There you go. This box has been pretty good. Better than that Fusion Strike box I opened that time. Oh my god. Still have another box of that. I don't know. One day we're feeling like oh, I never I didn't sleeve this one I should sleeve this as well not super valuable but it's a cool looking card I like it so last pack hopefully we get some last pack magic here it's a heavy pack that's when you know you're really into Pokemon when you start weighing packs because the uh, hollows weigh more yep Okay, last pack. Here we go. Oh, Star Me. Also a good choice. Okay. A lot of nose pass. I was just thinking there was a lot of nose pass. A lot pass. of nose pass. Garchomp holographic. Not the best way to end off, but you know. I thought this one was the holographic. This is the reverse holo. Reverse holo. So is reverse hollows? Worth they're not as they're not as desirable as holographics. I still sleeve them and put them in my collection, but they're not really worth much. But I would say that I can't complain with this. Some good pulls here. So yeah, let's go and put this in the collection. So thank you very much for joining me and. Thanks for having you me. You clearly have the touch. And uh, we'll be back with another video pretty soon and more breaks to come.